Good afternoon, all, and welcome to the Wall School for Advisors breakout session at Canadian Advisor Tech Expo 2024. Thank you for joining me today to discuss how WellScope for Advisors interactive tools can help automate your portfolio reviews and ultimately give you an edge when it comes to building relationships with clients and driving client retention in a competitive market. Let's start out by laying out some expectations for the session. The goal is to keep things simple and engaging. We'll start by briefly going over who and what WellScope for Advisors is for those who don't know already. Then we'll call out which specific problems and pain points we identified based on our research of the advisor client relationship, which ultimately drove us to building our platform. As we go over each of these potential challenges, we'll run through the practical applications for WellScope Portfolio Insights to address them and hopefully explain why financial advisors across Canada use WellScope for Advisors to add value to their portfolio reviews and differentiate their services. And finally, we'll wrap with a couple of reasons as to what really makes WellScope as a brand and company stand out amongst the crowd of other portfolio insights providers. As we work through this agenda, the hope is that we will explore and learn more about the practical applications of portfolio insights and why they're valuable to clients in general. We'll also identify the shortcoming of traditional portfolio insights, as well as the tangible consequences of the inefficiencies they cause on a financial advisor's business, and ultimately demonstrate WellScope's ability to supplement and support financial advisors with those inefficiencies. Without further ado, so who is WellScope? WellScope is a cloud-based software as a service business that delivers powerful portfolio insights backed by award-winning finance expertise, which is then packaged into proprietary tools to ultimately help improve investor outcomes. And our CEO, Pauline Shum Nolan, said it best, and she put it very simply. We are a team of wealth tech enthusiasts with a common goal of making portfolio analysis and planning modern, robust, and accessible. This is what we come to work to do every day. So not only do we have PhDs, a CFA, and others who are educated in finance, but each of us is enthusiastic about personal finance and portfolio management. With WellScope, you get access to an app built by a team who is thorough, who cares, and who will be responsive to your needs. And you don't have to take my word for it. Whether you've known it's us or not, many of you have likely come across WellScope Portfolio Insights either being featured in popular industry publications such as the Globe and Mail, Yahoo Finance, and even the latest OSC Test Lab report, or being leveraged by top brokerages and institutions such as Qtrade and CI Direct Trading. To help the audience understand why we decided to build WellScope for advisors, let's evaluate some of the common challenges or inefficiencies that we identified in the client advisor communication chain, specifically related to portfolio level information sharing and responding to client investment inquiries. Keep in mind as we go through this, these pain points were identified through thorough research and over years of speaking with financial advisors who have used our platform. At a high level, we group them, regroup these challenges into six key themes or areas of inefficiency. The first one being responsive advice. So how do we remain responsive while still maintaining that high standard, high quality of advice? How do, and the next one being, you know, consistently engaging clients throughout the year. You know, some, there's not always things to engage clients with, but we know that client engagement leads to client satisfaction, leads to client loyalty. So how do we consistently engage clients as a challenge? Next one being client education. Right? How do we mean? How do we fulfill that commitment to growing and building our clients' financial literacy? That's always a challenge. This one's a timely one. Market volatility. So when markets are volatile or uncertain, how do we deal with the increased number of client inquiries and potential emotional responses from clients? Of course, there's regulatory scrutiny, or for lack of a better word, compliance. And for our presentation, KYP due diligence. That's always, we're always looking for ways to streamline those processes as advisors. And the last one is delivering personalized advice at scale. So how do we, you know, make it feel like this advice is tailored to the client while still delivering that type of service to a large client book with diverse needs, right? And so we'll break each of these down more specifically throughout the presentation, but this is meant to lay the foundation for the demos uh, and the practical applications of portfolio insights and then later how WellScope can be used to enhance your client services tremendously by addressing these areas. And what you might have noticed is, is that these fall under three main buckets. So a theme surrounding time and effort, uh, a theme surrounding the delivery of the advice and a theme surrounding compliance. So that's how we'll kind of move our way through this presentation and, and explore these different challenge areas.
Let's start by examining the time and effort inefficiencies and challenges that we've identified in the absence of portfolio insights. This bucket has a significant impact on client loyalty and retention. So things like delivering responsive advice, proactively communicating amidst market volatility, and consistently engaging clients with thoughtful content and portfolio reviews are all crucial to delivering high quality services that foster trust in clients and keep them valuing your service for years to come. However, each of these objectives comes with their own specific challenges. And what we've come to realize is that when these processes are not optimized, they can drag down productivity and become tasks that require extensive resources at the opportunity cost of your time and energy that you could be putting into growing your business. So for example, a portfolio review that you complete with your client on a semi-annual basis. This is an example of consistent client communications. Now, well so for advisors users, use portfolio reviews to initiate productive conversations with their clients about their investments and to ensure that their clients remain engaged and feel their advisor is taking a proactive approach. Similarly, Wellscope for Advisors users also use portfolio reviews to address market volatility concerns amongst their clients and provide the necessary reassurance and education to help clients understand market cycles and relative performance. Now, obviously, doing any of this manually would require you to pull data into a spreadsheet, crunch the numbers, and formulate your recommendations. Amongst a couple of other challenges, you know, with Wellscope for Advisors, we automate these steps for you. So now let's take a look at how we can do this with the Wellscope Portfolio we'll Scorecard. How we can use Wellscope to increase productivity, streamline portfolio reviews, and generate content and materials that will not only keep clients engaged, but have them reassured by your proactive approach. And you can see, using our aggregation service, you can have Wellscope provide you with daily updates of your clients' accounts, meaning there's no need to for you to pull or extract data from other software, we'll lay out all the information for you right here on the Wellscope dashboard. And sticking with that practical example of a portfolio review, let's say myself and my client Camilla complete a semi-annual review of her self-directed TFSA as a routine. So you can see I have all of this information here, her portfolio holdings, as well as just generally her asset allocation. But if I did wanna complete a portfolio review, what I do is I'd click the analyze button here, and you can see I have a pretty comprehensive overview of her portfolio. I have the holdings again, an overall score, as well as the more granular uh, evaluations of her portfolio of these five or six, depending on the portfolio strategy um, um, factors, right? And so what I can do as the advisor is I can use this control panel in order to customize the information that I would like to share with Camilla and to make it align with the type of recommendations and information we're gonna go over. So for example, I know that Camilla is not looking to generate income with this portfolio. So I might click off the include income score and we can see that dynamically affecting the analysis. As well, let's say, you know, we don't rebalance it monthly, we rebalance it quarterly, so I can change that. Doesn't have an impact on the score, but we do have that flexibility to make that change. And now, sticking with the theme of market volatility and this portfolio review, we can use that the recent history in the markets as a precursor. I know that Camilla might have some concerns as to why her portfolio has been down compared to last year. And I might want to use this visualization, the hypothetical portfolio history chart, to make the point that, you know, typically actually historically over the long term this portfolio has been quite resilient even during periods of crisis as we in wellscope identify with these gray bars we can see the portfolio over time has been quite resistant as compared to its closest comparable benchmark and that yes okay it's it's come down in the past year but it's actually recovered a little bit more than the benchmark and so these are the types of things that we can call out using this visualization. Of course, that's very helpful. But what we can also do is we can also click into these individual tabs and then take a little bit more of a specific look. So if I needed to, I could make the point that for this portfolio, the downside risk has actually been less than the closest comparable benchmark. We can see that in the total risk. We can see that in the downside risk. We can see that in the downside capture. And then if I go ahead and I show the performance metrics, I can see that this portfolio actually has a higher annualized return despite the lower risk, as well as better risk to reward ratios across the board, which makes sense. So these are the types of metrics that we can explain to our client, coupled with the data vi visualization to get that point across about a long-term perspective, you know, reassuring them about market volatility and uncertainty going forward, that you know, we've taken the right steps to make sure that this portfolio is, re is resilient and sure we can make some tweaks depending on perhaps your goals, but you know, this allows you to create that reassurance and not only create it, but create it efficiently and answer these 
client inquiries efficiently. So this is just one example of how we can use the Wellscope Portfolio Scorecard to consistently engage clients with portfolio reviews and also help reassure them during times of market uncertainty where their emotions might be high and they will be expecting, you know, responsive advice, but still uh, reassuring advice. Let's also use a quick client inquiry to explore how Wellscope can help advisors research process, thereby improving responsiveness when clients reach out with questions regarding their investments. So say we receive an inquiry from a client who's been following the news and they're really interested in Apple because of their recent developments they've been seeing, like Apple has banking products now, they, they're doing buy now, pay later, and you know they just released their iPhone 15, right? So they're, they're doing pretty well. Um, however, your client is asking what their level of exposure to Apple is and if they should actually increase their exposure. Now, when we get an inquiry like this, if we don't have the data and we don't have a tool, it's going to take a lot of time and it's going to take a lot of effort for us to pull the numbers and calculate their exposures. And that has a lag on our ability to be responsive and give that quick, reliable delivery that our clients are expecting from us. But when we use Wellscope, all I have to do is type in the ticker here, click the button, and we're going to sift through all of this client's accounts and compute the actual exposure uh, this client has to Apple. So we can see that Apple accounts for about 1.4% of their holdings, around $5,000 worth um, of market value, and is located in two of their accounts. Now, does this client hold Apple directly? Oh no, it looks like they don't. But do they hold it indirectly? Yes, they do. So they hold Apple in various ETFs that they hold in these two investment accounts that they have with us. And so that is probably why they're asking us this question about their exposure to Apple and if they should increase it. They're likely not aware that they do have indirect exposures to Apple through the ETFs that we've set them up with. And so this is a type of you know, quality analysis and insights that you can expect with Wellscope products. And you can see how fast that was. So we're able to quickly punch the stock into Wellscope's stock exposure lookup tool, find the information, then quickly turn around and flip it over to the client. And along with some commentary, you know, whatever advice you would want to give them, you can provide. And this is meant to expedite your research process and improve the uh, delivery of the advice, right? The way that this is broken down and then supplement the commentary that you would like to provide your clients. So that's just an example, again, of how, you know, Wellscope and Quality Portfolio Insights tools might be able to solve inefficiencies relating to time and effort challenges when it comes to client inquiries. By now, we've covered the first set of challenges related to the time and effort required to develop portfolio insights and share them with clients responsibly. Now, we'll continue by exploring the second main challenge theme, which is the quality of our advice being delivered at scale. Similar to the previous bucket, these challenges will also have a significant impact on client satisfaction and retention. Providing personalized advice and tailoring a delivery that embodies a commitment to enhancing your client's financial literacy is proven not only to contribute meaningfully to long-term trust, but it can also lead to more business growth opportunities. Clients will appreciate your investment in delivering quality, personalized advice consistently and will be more likely to refer their friends and family to your firm. That said, quality advice delivery is an art and it takes constant iteration to perfect it at scale. For example, think about how we typically approach a conversation with a client who is interested in retirement planning services. To develop tailored advice, an advisor must take time to understand the person's retirement goals, lifestyle, and current financial situation. Often, as advisors' client books grow, it becomes increasingly more tedious to maintain that same level of personalization, especially with traditional tools or manual processes. On top of that, when complex subject matter and industry jargon are involved, the client can become easily overwhelmed. With Wellscope's dynamic integrated planning tools, advisors are able to have a nuanced discussion about a retiree's current and future financial planning needs and truly accelerate the rate at which we can deliver personalized advice. At to exemplify how Wellscope enhances your ability to deliver personalized advice, let's look at our newest integrated planning tool, the Optimal Drawdown for Couples. This tool frames well for clients approaching retirement or those who are already retired. Advisors can use the Optimal Drawdown for Couples to help visualize a joint drawdown strategy to reduce the total tax bill between partners. Overall, the tool itself aims to maximize after-tax income while maintaining a smooth consumption path and will tell a retiree how much they can afford to spend per year given their actual savings and retirement income. 
And so let's dive into the tool and see how we can generate an efficient but personalized drawdown plan for a couple named Peter and Mary. Okay, just to save us time for the presentation, I've already gone ahead and entered all the inputs that we need for the couple's drawdown. So let's dive in and take a look at what's needed for this tool to run this calculation. First thing we need is a bit of personal information about the couple. So their current age, as well as the time horizon for the drawdown plan. Then we need some information about their retirement income. So any government pension that they have from CPP or OAS, any employer pension, as well as any annual other taxable income. So whether that be from a rental property or what have you. Next thing we need is the post-retirement uh, investment portfolio. So here, each partner chooses an investment portfolio that they will be investing in post-retirement. And what makes this tool unique is that Wellscope can run the optimal drawdown calculation with any portfolio, any hypothetical, or even their actual portfolio. And we do this by generating 10,000 simulations, which leaves us with a distribution of outcomes. And that's a key feature of this tool. And we'll see how you can use that to deliver better advice at the end of this. Um, next thing we need is the account values of the actual accounts that each spouse has. So how much do they have in their taxable accounts? How much do they have in their registered RIFs? How much do they have in their TFSA? And whether this couple wants to leave behind any bequest. The last thing we need is the investment scenario. So here's where the distribution of outcomes comes into play. You can choose to either see the median outcome or a poor outcome. And this decision helps us as the advisor better illustrate to the client how investment returns and volatility can impact their retirement plans using the cho chosen portfolio. And then what we can always do is go back and edit the plan and choose a different portfolio to see how that impacts our financial future as well. But once we've inputted all of these values, let's go ahead and click calculate and see what this tool can generate for us. And once the tool is has completed its calculation, we're going to see a breakdown of the tax savings that these two spouses can achieve by filing a coupled tax return. So what we see on the results page is a breakdown of the first five years of tax savings. So in the first year, Peter and Mary are going to achieve a tax savings of $822 on their tax bill. So what this tool does is it first derives the optimal drawdown plan for each partner separately. And so that's the breakdown that we see at the top of the table here. If they file separately, their total tax bill is around $1,600. These are their after-tax spending levels as well as their pension income. Then the tool checks whether pension income splitting can reduce their total tax bill and whether they qualify for the spousal credit and transfer of unused age and pension credits from one spouse to another. And so that's broken down in the bottom half of the table where we see that their total tax bill has been reduced to $750 using the pension income transfer credit. And what the big ticket number here is really that over the course of the optimal drawdown planning horizon, this these two spouses can achieve tax savings of $10,000 in total. And so these are the inputs that we see with the couple drawdown. Now we can also see a breakdown of the individual drawdown plan for each person. So here we can see an example of if Peter were to file his taxes separately from Mary as an individual. What we see at first is that he can afford to spend $150,000 per year after tax and his tax implications over the planning horizon will be just over $460,000. We can also scroll down and see a further breakdown of what his scenario would look like as an individual, starting with his first year income sources, where we break down all of the income, how he should draw down from his various income sources with these helpful visualizations. We also break down his spending versus his taxes here and we can keep going overall. So there's a lot of information there, but overall, once the results are generated, advisors can save these plans to a client and reference them in the future. So you click this button to do that. And you can also edit the plan and change any assumption, such as the investment portfolio, for example, and we can change it to compare how to con contra compare and contrast how a client's decision making today can impact their ability to achieve their future goals. So the intuitive interface and the easy to understand graphs and visualizations can really accelerate the speed at which these goal-based planning discussions can occur while delivering the insights in a digestible display for the client. Overall, this demonstration highlights how even Wellscope's most complicated integrated planning tools accelerate an advisor's efficiency in deliver delivering personalized financial planning advice with no sacrifice to the quality and depth of your advice. So the previous tool was a prime example of how Wellscope's integrated planning tools can be used to personalize the portfolio and financial planning advice that you're providing to your client at scale. Now let's look at a different example, which is how we can use Wellscope to enhance your ability to educate clients on a portfolio level approach and their portfolio strategy in general. So focusing on that other component, client education 
which is part of our advice delivery challenge. For example, let's say a client has expressed a lot of interest in adding cryptocurrency assets to their investments. They've investigated you know, the recent rally of Bitcoin and they believe it'll be smart to have some exposure to this. To address their acquire inquiry, let's use Wellscope to take a look at the risk contribution that this type of speculative asset would have on their portfolio. So let's say I've already got their portfolio in Wellscope and I have set up this portfolio, this hypothetical portfolio to have a 2.5% allocation to Bitcoin and Ethereum separately. Now we've seen this before. This is the portfolio scorecard. Uh, we've also even gone into the controls and the tabs. But to answer this type of inquiry, I might want to go into the diversification tab, click the individual perspective. And what we'll be able to see is the risk contribution of the different components in the portfolio. So here we see two pie charts, one showing us the general asset allocation in this portfolio and one showing us the risk contribution of each of the assets held in the portfolio. And so if we if we take a look at the Bitcoin and Ethereum holdings, we can see, yep, as I said before, the asset allocation generally. But then when we look at the risk contribution, we see that Bitcoin has a 13.11% risk contribution and Ethereum has a 28.09% risk contribution compared to their very small general allocation in the portfolio. And so using these visualizations is, is also helpful while having these types of numbers. And we can make the point that these speculative investments have an outsized impact on the risk of the portfolio. So now we've seen that example of, you know, being able to educate the client with visualizations to explore these types of portfolio ideas with them quickly. And then you can move on to your recommendation as to, you know, what allocation, if any, you recommend in terms of you know buying cryptocurrency and adding it to this portfolio. So just again, Wellscope scorecards are quick and highly effective at educating clients on complex topics such as diversification, allow allowing you to deliver personalized advice at scale and enhance your advice delivery using these tools. Now that we've covered the challenges relating to delivering personalized advice at scale and an example of how we can use the Wellscope portfolio scorecard to educate clients about a portfolio level approach, Let's move on to the third and final bucket, which covers challenges surrounding compliance. As it relates to portfolio reviews and insights, let's specifically talk about know your product and supplementing how you might determine suitability in tandem with your KYC software or existing processes. Everyone here knows that for good reason, compliance standards are always evolving and regulators continue to push towards higher expectations. While that's necessary, without the right processes and automation in place, tracking your compliance efforts can be a real drag on productivity as well as your ability to actually engage in servicing your clients. For this reason, Wellscope for Advisors users use Wellscope in order to supplement their KYP processes. The portfolio scorecard allows advisors to not only leverage their data to support their recommendations, but also demonstrate an investment and commitment to client best interest. Throughout 2022, we worked as part of the OSC Test Lab initiative to discover how we could better supply KYP tools to advisors to ultimately help streamline their compliance objectives. As a result, we added many new features, such as the ability to customize the portfolio scorecard to align with your advice, as you see on the screen right now, as well as new integrated goal-based planning tools, such as the retirement blueprint, or the optimal drawdown for couples, which we saw earlier in this presentation, to help advisors meet these expectations with efficiency. And one more thing is that all of our tools are shareable and downloadable, so you can easily upload them to your, your compliance tracking software or share them with your clients as needed. Finally, we've covered who we are at Wellscope as well as our mission. Then we worked through the common challenges and inefficiencies that we observed in the market in absence of quality portfolio insights. We also saw quite a few practical use cases for Wellscope for advisors and how to best use it to optimize time and effort, advice delivery, and KYP compliance workflows. Now, at this point, you might be saying to yourself, well, I already use a portfolio management or insight software, or what really makes this software stand out from the rest? So I'll take the last minute or so here to explain why Wellscope for Advisors is a unique solution that can truly provide you with a competitive edge. And the first advantage is self-explanatory, being that we are a cost-effective solution. Relative to comparable products on the market, Wellscope comes in at an unbeatable price, as you can see on screen, and we're confident that you will notice a positive ROI by using our software. Next, account aggregation, something that I mentioned, but I didn't go into depth about. We have the capacity to quickly ingest your client data and have it refreshed daily. 
If you work with private funds and proprietary products, perhaps, we're also more than capable of working with your fund accountants and broker dealers to safely ingest this data. We're extremely flexible in this way, which is quite rare in this industry. And I touched on this briefly as well, but our customer service team is responsive and provides quality support in under 24 hours. Not to mention, our team members genuinely do care about this stuff and we ensure that we're thorough so you can expect the highest class of customer service and access to the team that is actually building and maintaining this app. Finally, Wellscope's modern UI and context clues really set us apart from other softwares. We spend countless hours uh, working on your experience with our software and making it as intuitive and easy as possible. The context clues and data visualizations make it that much easier for you to paint a story behind the numbers and deliver quality advice to your clients. So overall, thank you all again for attending the breakout session. I hope it was informative and that the demos of the practical applications or a good use of your time. Uh, I'll now open the floor to any questions, and if you want to have a one-on-one -on -one demo with myself of how you might be able to implement uh, Wellscope Portfolio Insights, please use the link in the booth to book a time that works best for you. And uh, yeah, thanks again.